Hi, first, welcome to Bulgaria. Thank you. How are you? I'm really good. You are one of the great artists that our fans are expecting tonight. You are their favorite one. Can you? How are you about this? Me? Um, I feel really good. You know, it's my first time ever in Bulgaria here. So. Um, Where did you come from? So I come from uh, Paris, uh -huh. and because uh, I'm on tour right now, yeah. and um, I come from Paris, and uh, yeah, I'm really excited about the performance tonight and just being here for the first time and discover my my Bulgarian fans and the Bulgarian audience okay. just can't wait. Can you tell us your story behind your nickname Pokora because it's not your real name yeah, actually. Pokora is, um, it means, it means uh, humili humility in, um, in, 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 um, in French, in, in, it's French. Polish, Pokora, it's humility uh -huh. and, um, and why I choose this name because First, I'm originally from Poland. My grandparents yeah. are from Poland, and um, uh, for me, it's just something really important to stay humble. Don't forget where you come from. Respect the people wherever they are from. So, um, for me, it's a real important value, yeah. and uh, I just wanted to have it riding on my arm. So don't forget about it. And uh, when I choose the, my my name for my solo career, then I was thinking about a lot of names. I was like, Matt, what, Matt, 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 Matt. Oh, it's written on my arm, Matt Picora. Okay, <laughs> let's talk about your uh, last album, MP3. Actually, it's your first English album. Do you have favorite song in it? Um, I think Dangerous is my favorite song. Uh, that's why I choose it as a first single um, and it was our favorite song uh, in the studio with Timbaland and everybody, all the team. Um, first time we did it, we were like, oh, that's a big hit, that's gonna be the first single, definitely. And um, until today is my favorite song on the album. Favorite one. Yeah. And it's just a matter of time for the to play with your mind. Supersonic on her eyes, I saw hypnotic yeah. I used to think that she was innocent But she's got the fashion That girl is dangerous Better be careful That girl is dangerous Now about the work with Timbaland How actually did you contact him And how it's to work with uh, such a great producer? Uh, Timbaland, um, I met him because of Nelly Furtado, because yeah. I performed with her at the Energy Music Awards in France. Yeah, which in song it was? Uh, it was a promiscuous, promiscuous girl. Promiscuous, right? Then she um, she talked about me to her to Timberland's manager, yeah. and she said, "Yeah, this guy's gonna make an English album. You have to work with him. You have to meet him." And um, and then first I met Timberland's manager in New York, yeah. and um, right after that he loved my project and the things that I wanted to do on this new album and he went to speak to Timberland himself and said you have to meet this guy and then we met in Paris with Timberland and, um, and that's how everything came up. Is it pressure to work with him? It's a little bit more pressure than with another pr producer because it's somebody who influenced my music since I'm 14 years old you know so I have a lot of respect for him but you know it's just the work between a producer and an artist, you know, it's the same way to work that I work with other producers, you know, we are in the studio, we compose together, we, we try different ideas together and uh, that's the way I work with him is, was kind of the same way that I work with the other producers. Okay, uh, you have a song with Ricky Martin, you work with Timberlake. Actually, uh, do you mind to work with some, uh, somebody else? I mean, you plan to make a deal with a woman, for example? Mm, I really would love to work with um, Pharrell Williams uh -huh. for the next album. Uh, and um, I met people like Will I Am. I, I had a great feeling with him, and I think we will make something together for, for the next album. Okay, I know that you. So I see you have interesting qualities. What do they say actually? 
this is the way I think, the way I live, you know, for example. When did you uh, get? The first tattoo? The first one. I was 17 years old. You were 17, so five years? Six years, years. no, five years five ago. Five years ago, right. What's uh, written here? Here it's the name of my uh, of my uh, nephew, my niece. Uh huh. Um, you know, that's my religious arm. Okay. And, um, <laughs> Here there is nothing special, it's not meanings, but I have different meanings all over my body and it's just the way I think, the way I live and things yeah. like that. The place you define as your home because in your MySpace it's written LA, New York, Paris, Virginia, Virginia Beach. Beach. <laughs> Where is your place? No, it's uh, Paris first. Okay. Paris definitely, you know, it's where I'm from, I'm French and I'm proud of it. Uh, and I love Paris, uh -huh. but after Paris, I think it's LA and then New York. Many people call you the European Justin Timberlake. What do you think about this person? About Justin? Yeah, they call you the European Justin yeah, yeah. Timberlake. Yeah. What do you think about this? I think it's because they don't really know me. Um, I really love his work and what he is doing, you know, I have a lot of respect for him. But Do you know him? Hmm? Do you know him? No, I never met him. Mm -hmm. I never met him. Um, but I think, you know, he's really good artist, I have a lot of respect for him, but, you know, I'm just trying to do what I want to do, you know, yeah. and um, I think just people compare me to him because I'm a new artist and I dance and I'm white. And you if I will be. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> if I will be black, they will probably come from me to somebody else, yeah. you know. So I just think it's because of, you yeah. know, the the blonde hair and the, yeah. you know. But you know, when I do my tattoos, I'm not gonna, tr I'm not trying to have the same look than Justin Timberlake. Or whatever. Okay. What's next? Song, uh, songs, singles, albums, tours. Uh, going to do? I'm on tour na right now. Uh, the tour finish in. Uh, in uh, December, so before the end of the of the year, I'm gonna go visit other countries uh, like Sweden, Finland, Mexico, Germany, a lot of country, and um, and then beginning of 2009, I'm gonna take a little break uh -huh. to rest, and then start to work on the new album. Okay, thank you so much. Can you tell me something nice in French, please? Nice in French? Yeah. Vous êtes très joli. It sounds nice. <laughs> Thank you so much. My pleasure. Uh, wish you a really great show performance tonight. I'll see you on the stage. Thank you so Thank much you and good luck. Thank you. My pleasure. Thank you.